up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another Tile Tool Tuesday. I have a rigid tile saw to review for you guys. This is a very unique tile saw with a drop gate design for your large format tiles, two foot, three foot, all the way up to four and five foot tiles. So what we're gonna do as per usual, unbox the saw, assemble it and test it. But first let's quickly go over the specs. Drop gate design for extended rip capacity, folding stand, adjustable laser alignment, full cover splash guard, aluminum miter guide and rip fence, micro cut fence support, a tilting head for 22 and a half and 45 degree miter cuts, a plunging head, cast aluminum frame and a five gallon water tray. Without further ado, let's take it outside and assemble. Water tray, register for your lifetime warranty, to cut diagonal, already assembled stand, which I love, your fence, bolts to mount the motor, your aluminum tray, your eight inch rigid diamond blade. Here is your motor, which does feel fairly light, and your main water tray. Let's quickly mount the motor your onboard tools, mounting the blade. You can adjust the height, three different levels. I'm going to make this stand as tall as possible. I am six foot three, quick and simple with these pins. And this is one of the best parts of the saw. Of course you have a fence here. You also have a fence on the back. You can raise it for your fence or lower it for your large format tile, porcelain planks, anything from two feet all the way up to five feet. You can simply use this to square it off. Awesome design. Since we all know tiles are getting bigger and bigger and big tiles are not going anywhere. Okay, let's plug it in, add five gallons of water and test the accuracy as well as the power of this eight inch rigid tile saw. But first, let's show you a couple of clips in action on site with one of our bathroom remodels. All right, here we are. Our tile saw is all newly assembled on site right now. Gonna make a rip on hard porcelain. I've already tested the motor. The motor is loud. This saw screams, but this is why we would want something like this, a smaller, version of a wet tile saw an eight inch for our tight space in this backyard. So let's quickly show you. So here's our tile saw. Our D 36,000 would not fit in this area. All set up, ready to go. Let's make this quick cut. See how clean it cuts and how powerful this motor is for the rigid. So I'm using the plunge option for my tapered cut at the ceiling of the shower. powerful little motor and a clean cut. Let's show you how this small, lightweight, compact tile saw, eight inch by rigid, cuts very big, hard porcelains. Here we go.
get this 36 inch tile textured with ease. High gloss, 39 inch hard porcelain tile. Let's see how clean it will cut this big boy here. Extremely clean cut, rigid does equip this tile saw with a good diamond blade. If you can see that there, that looks factory without a diamond pad. Now let's do the 48 inch tile. Just like that, not a problem. If you're having problems cutting big, long tiles like this, 48 inches, your solution, this eight inch rigid with the adjustable dropping down fence. Well, there you have it, very impressive, small, lightweight, compact, eight inch wet tile saw that can cut your massive hard porcelain tiles all the way up to a four or a five foot tile. Highly recommended. I like it, lifetime warranty, strong motor, good diamond blade, great saw for the money. As per usual, do not forget to subscribe, tap that bell notification for the next Tile Tool Tuesday, and smash that like button, and I'll see you guys on the next one.